majority of people ruin their lives one small decision, one bad habit, one day at a time. Over a series of years, they end up in a really bad place. They will summarize a lifetime of bad decisions in one sentence. Yeah, he was really irresponsible, and so eventually the company fired him. But he didn't get fired because of one bad decision. It was a series. Read in the Bible those summary statements. One day, Samson went down to Gaza where he saw a prostitute. Gaza is 25 miles from Samson's hometown, Zora, the Philistine headquarter where Samson was public enemy. So Samson might have walked 25 miles into enemy territory to see a prostitute. Do you know how many steps it takes to go 25 miles? Approximately 56,250 steps. In that instance, he took 56,250 steps in a direction that would begin a life of spiraling downward because of one bad decision, one step, one bad habit, one day at a time. He ended up in a life that completely fell apart. What one habit do you need to break? Let's talk for a moment about why this is difficult. There is a perceived benefit immediately. It's fun to do what's wrong at first. For example, you wanna smoke a ciggy. This feels good, this, this makes me relaxed, okay? And the cost isn't until years later when they tell you bad news about your lung. Bad habit looks appealing in the short run. What we're gonna do on the other hand is we're gonna make it difficult to do. If you read the story and you don't know it, when kings go off to war, David stayed back at the palace. When he wasn't where he wasn't supposed to be, he ended up at the wrong time going up on the rooftop, which happened to be his neighbor's bath time, and so he started checking it out. Wrong place, wrong time, led him to see something he shouldn't have seen, which led him to do something that he shouldn't have done. The guy wasn't a bad guy. He genuinely loved God. You're not a bad person if you continue to fall into the same ruts. You can genuinely love God, but if you're in the wrong place at the wrong time, you might find yourself doing something you never wanted to do. Take that bad thing, the thing you don't tell anybody, or that thing that's kind of annoying, whatever it is. If you play that forward 5, 10, 15, 20 years, here's what you will say in the future. I had no idea how much this was gonna cost me. Didn't do it all at once. One small bad habit over time. Based on who you wanna become, what habit are you gonna break? But I feel so weak. Great. Because when you are weak, Christ's strength is made perfect. He will never let you be tempted beyond what you can bear. He will always give you a way out. There's always a way out. Think about Samson, 56,250 steps in the wrong direction. It was also 56 1,250 opportunities to stop, to turn around. Today is a day for you to stop making excuses. Some of you, it's time to quit putting it off.